Hi everyone, my name is Ritesh and I am a business development manager. So today I am going to give you a demo on telemedicine solution. So before I could talk about the telemedicine or uh, before I could give you the demo on telemedicine, I would like to inform you that this telemedicine application is completely customizable as per your unique needs. So if you would like to make any kind of changes or you know changes to the functionalities or the workflow, we can do that for you. Apart from that, this solution is completely integrated. So basically, we can integrate the system with your EHR. So whatever data that you mentioned, it will be reflected on this application. And at the same time, patients can also book appointment and your receptionist will receive that request. So I'm going to start with the demo now. So here you can see the home page of uh, telemedicine application or a portal you can say this e-clinic logo and the background image and the color everything can be customized so we can put your logo your clinics or your hospital logo here okay. here uh, I can just go ahead and log in as a patient so if I click on this I can log in with the help of my mobile number and password but if I'm not registered patient, I can click on register now, which is right here at the bottom. And once I click on uh, page, uh, register now, I will get this page and I will have to fill in some details like first name, last name, email ID, phone number. I can create my own password and then I will be able to log in. So right now, I will just go ahead and log in first and then I will show you how it looks. So I already have registered one patient just to show you an example. So I will just log in with this patient. As soon as I log in, I will land up on this page called patient dashboard. Here I will be able to see the appointment. I can see the medicine prescription which has been uh, given by the doctor and the lab results. On the left hand side, you can see appointments. So it will show you all the upcoming visits, your past visits with the help of date range, and you can go ahead and book appointment. Okay. Now you can also check lab test. So right now there is no data because there is no lab test available and the prescription available. So you will not be able to see it here now, but once the doctor orders for it, you will be able to see it. You can also check your profile and you will see all the details. And if you would like to edit uh, your, your uh, details here, you can do that. Here you will get uh, the photo of the patient. So right now what we will do is we will just go ahead and click on book appointment. As soon as the patient clicks on book appointment, he will be able to see all the departments or the specialties which are available in the clinic or the hospital. So let's say patient would like to select general practitioner for now. So I will click on general practitioner. Once I click on that, I will be able to see all the doctors that are available in that particular department that is in general practitioner department. So let's say if the doctor wants, uh, uh, let's say if the patient wants to book appointment for Mr. Dr. Mustafa. So he will just click on book appointment. As soon as you click book appointment, you will be able to see all the empty slots that are published by the doctor. So right now I will take one slot. So right now my time is 12.58 a.m. here. So I would rather go for let's say 1 a.m. And then here, if I'm going to visit the clinic, I can click here or I can check this box. That's for video visit. So we'll click here. I will confirm the appointment and appointment booked successfully. And I will go to the dashboard. As soon as I go to the dashboard, I can go to the appointment as a patient. And then I will click on join visit. As soon as I click on join visit, I will get this questionnaire, which is not mandatory to fill in. But if you would like to have your own questionnaire as per your clinic or hospital, 
we can put it over here or we can design it for you so for now i will just put the problem rashes on skin i will click on submit and then i will get this one as soon as i get this one the doctor will get a pop-up and doctor will also uh, join the televisit so here the doctor i have already logged in as a doctor with the ehr so this is the ehr for the doctor so doctor will log into his system he will see there is one new patient which is ready for the televisit he will acknowledge he will select and then he's ready to join the video call so the patient from his application it's right here he will click start televisit and the doctor as soon as i start televisit i will put the name of the patient i will click on join room and same way doctor here you can do the same okay video calling we will put the name of the doctor join room okay so the reason why you're seeing three different images is because right now i'm logged in as doctor as a patient and i'm using go to meeting uh, to record this demo okay so this is how uh, the patient the patient here and the doctor here can can interact with each other through video calling okay now i'm going to hang up and i will show you how it looks once the consultation is done so i will hang up from here all right so the call hung up okay so i will go as a patient i will go to the dashboard again i will go to my appointment and i will see that i have uh, spoke or i was on the video call with this doctor for 15 minutes so it will also show you uh, the duration of the call okay now apart from this if you would like to make any kind of changes now let's say if you would like to have a visit summary uh, somewhere here or somewhere here we can do that for you if you would like to have uh, the billing screen if you would like to uh, upload invoices so everything can be done it is completely customizable as per your requirement but this is just the generic demo which i already showed it to you and for now that's all about the telemedicine solution if you have any any questions you can get back to me all right thank you so much for now